It's time once again for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. Hello, everybody. It's Uncle Matt, and I'm here to read you another bedtime story. And tonight's bedtime story is special. It's about road trips, and it's spring break over here. A lot of people are going on road trips flying away on vacations, and uh, just having some fun to try to escape all this COVID stuff. So I want to read a story about road trips and two of my favorite dogs. Yes, it's Fred and Ted. Another adventure with Fred and Ted. Fred and Ted's Road Trip by Peter Eastman. Yeah. And it's kind of based on the story of um, P.D. Eastman. Um, so here we go. Here, should mention, it's copyright 2011. Okay. Fred and Ted's Road Trip. Are you ready? Put your seatbelts on. Fred and Ted were going on a road trip. Ted packed the lunch. Fred packed the tools. They drove away. Ted drove on the road. Fred drove on the grass. Hmm. They came to a big mud puddle. Fred drove into it. Ted drove around it. They stopped at a water hose. Ted was clean. Fred was dirty. Ted turned on the water. He stayed dry. Fred got wet. They came to a log. Fred drove over it. Ted drove under it. They stopped to have a picnic. Ted carried the lunch. Fred spread the blanket. They sat down to eat. Ted felt one drop. Fred felt two drops. Kaboom! It started to rain. Ted ran to his red car. Fred ran to his green car. Ted drove in the rain. Fred drove out of the rain. They drove in the desert. Ted was cool. Fred was hot. They ran over some cactus. Fred got a flat tire. In the toolbox, Ted found a pump. Fred found a spoon. Ted pumped. Fred found apples. Ted pumped and pumped and pumped. Fred found bread and milk and a pineapple. Fred went up and up and up. Fred called for help from up in the air. Ted raced to help down on the ground. Uh oh. The bird stayed up. Fred went down. Back at home, safe and sound. Did they finish their picnic?
Yes, they did. Ted had a sandwich, Fred had a hard-boiled egg, and a pickle. The end. Well, very good. They did have a picnic after all. That is all the time we have for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. I hope you enjoyed that story, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.